Welcome back to another Minecraft Bedrock Edition tutorial, and in this one, I'll be showing you how to make this super simple, super easy 1.16 auto chicken cooker. So without further ado, guys, let's get straight into it. And as always, I've got a materials list for you guys, so just pause the video here, collect up all of these materials, and then come back and we'll get straight into the tutorial. But really quick, if you guys do find this video helpful or enjoyable, then please do consider subscribing. I'm trying to hit 2k by Christmas. Let's get into it. All right, building this thing is actually super simple and we're gonna get straight into things. The first thing you wanna do is set down a wall that is a two by three looking up vertically and then a one block gap and doing the same exact thing on the other side. You now want to take your chests and you're just going to lay them out like this with a hopper running into the back. And this is gonna be where all of the baby chickens are going to go and their drops are going to be collected. You then wanna set down a stone slab and then you want to get your glass ready and you're just gonna build up like this. This. You now want to get your dispenser in here looking into this stone slab with a hopper on top And this is going to be where all of the adult chickens are going to sit now What you can do is set down your lava in this hole right here So it, it is right above the stone slab this time and now you just want to cover this up with glass and do this in four directions all the way around this hopper just like that and again this is going to be where all of the adult chickens are going to go from the back here you want to grab your stone bricks again or whatever building block you chose and you want to make a shape that looks something like this so it's a two by two with one block right here you're going to run a comparator into this block and then you want to set down a redstone dust with a redstone repeater just like that break this block now and set down a redstone dust and this is going to make sure that the system does not lock because it will only let one egg into the dispenser at a time which will make sure that it doesn't overflow and doesn't break the system so with that being said all we have to do now is get our chickens in here and then you are completely done with this design it is super simple however it is super useful as this thing has been running for like uh, I think an hour and a half now so as you can see it works super well All you got to make sure is that you have a lot of chickens up here All right And the last step that you want to do once you have all of your chickens in place is set down a glass block on top And this is just gonna make sure that nothing gets in there because you don't want zombies in there or anything It's not gonna destroy the farm. It would just be a bit annoying to deal with especially if it's a creeper uh, But yeah, so you just want to place that block on top and this is going to do it for the farm. I should mention, you do not need this many. I just did it because I can and I'm in creative mode. However, if you're in survival mode, you really don't need more than 50 chickens because this is 200 chickens and this made this in about an hour and a half and I don't think anybody is going to be using this much cooked chicken but if you want that this is about 200 chickens and this is about the rates for an hour and a half with that being said I hope you guys did enjoy and again consider subscribing and leaving a like this is 1upMC and I will see you guys in the next one